Okay, this is where I headed with this project with the uh, semi-levitated or pseudo-levitated rotor to try to find a bearing that will last over the course of years and not cause a problem for stopping my uh, little microamp pulse motors. And I took the driver unit out of one of these solar waivers. They just pop out and just trimmed it down and put it in the bell jar. And this is a, a friction-free enough for that driver unit to work. And uh, what I may do to make it run overnight is uh, use a alkaline battery, um, 1.5 AAA alkaline battery, and use this. Now, I did uh, something similar to this back in 2017, and it is still running. And it only draws uh, 15 microamps during the day and then 40 microamps at night. And uh, with these uh, long-running alkaline batteries, I should get uh, a couple of years out of it, the way this is working out. And I'm going to give a link to that unit that has been running now. It'll be uh, two years in April. It's just uh, the guts out of one of these things uh, with the setup where you put the uh, AAA battery in parallel with the panel with a 30K resistor in there. And uh, this drops it down to about half a volt or so. And then, like I say, the, the amp draws is, is this. And I put the meter on it in the video. You can take a look at the video and see what I'm at. But I think I can hide this battery in the base there um, in such a way that uh, every couple of years I just uh, put in another battery and let it go at that. But uh, anyway, this is where I'm at with this project. And uh, Slider is working on the same thing. Uh, he's uh, he's about where I'm at on this. It's actually turned out to be a pretty neat little project. Thanks for watching.